In early childhood, we use documentation to capture children's ideas, words, and wonderings. I would estimate on one day we may take at least 100 pictures, if not 200 or more. <laughs> Last year, we were fortunate to be provided a new camera to take high quality photos. We share these photos through documentation with the children themselves, families, and the greater community to further project work and build connections. Every year, uh, the Diversity Council attends the MICDS Diversity Conference. It's, it's run like a proper conference, so they go from different workshops, um, and the point being that they go, they learn a bunch of stuff at the conference, and then they bring what they've learned back to our community to implement um, kind of all the cool stuff that they took part in that day. I would definitely encourage uh, families to give um, for these types of, or for diversity-based um, programming. A lot of the stuff that we do is not free um, and it requires either some type of um, entry free or some type of um, just some, some resources that we have um, that we would not be able to have without folks uh, giving to the annual fund. So um, it really, really helps out. The, the robot we chose to get was um, called Dash and it's from Wonder Workshop. They're wonderful tools for um, a playful approach to coding. So you under you you get a sense of how you can enter uh, requests into the computer, and it will respond, and that will be really fun for the kids. I really encourage parents this year to. Uh, donate whatever they can uh, to provide teachers with these opportunities that we can then we can learn from other teachers, learn new new ideas for the classroom and bring it back and implement it for our students. Theater, like human beings, we're a work in progress. And we can always update, we can always make it look better. It's never set in stone. No matter what production we do, we're going to need something. I would encourage parents to give to the annual fund for this and only, if only this reason. Your kid is going to be up on stage. And when your kid is on stage, you want your child, I always wanted my kids, to look and sound and be the best they can be. The buses are really some of the most important pieces of equipment that we have at the college school. And that is because it allows us to have the freedom to get out into the community. Uh, to learn from uh, authentic experiences, to be outside and paddle and climb and chase monarchs and cave and be out in lakes and rivers and all of that sort of thing. These buses allow us to do that. It's so important. We couldn't do any of that without these buses.